to ruin little Caddy and little Caddy's life. Let me think. That little Caddy has been getting up to lots of fun. Her and her poor boyfriend broke up. Boo hoo, as if that's the main of her problems. I'm gonna do something awful, something so terrible that no one will ever come back for it. I'm gonna infect that girl's brain so she can't speak properly. No one will understand her and she'll die from the brain infection. <laughs> it's gonna be amazing. Now to just go into the witch and get this potion. Now to sneak into that little Kelly's bedroom and see if she's there. I have a great plan. This is gonna be the best thing I've ever done. Oh, look at her. Lying there in her pretty pink bedroom. I'm thinking she's so amazing. I wonder what she's dreaming about. Oh, who's this? A new pet? <laughs> That's someone I can steal and get rid of. <laughs> but for now, let's kill little Kelly with a brain infection. There, take that. <laughs> I know she's infected. She's going to die. Ooh, oh, what a great sleep. Good morning, Buttons. Wait, why aren't you looking at me? Good morning, Cassie. Why aren't you purring at me? Good morning, guys. Come on. Oh, that's weird. Daisy, good morning. Hmm. I don't know what's up with them. Maybe they're just in a mood and they didn't sleep well. I'll go over to little Carly and see if she's awake. Good morning, little Carly. Are you awake yet? What's up? Are we going on an adventure? Oh, no. Nope. No one here either. Oh, I guess I'll go down to Mom and Dad and see how they are. I mean, it's just another boring day in the kingdom. Okay, let's go down here, down the slide. Woo! Let's see. Uh, good morning, Mom. Good morning, Dad. How are you today? Little Kelly, I can't understand you. What's wrong? What do you mean you can't understand me? I'm speaking perfect English. Okay, let me try this again. What? This is not working. Whatever I'm saying is coming out all in gibberish and my dad can't understand me. Maybe it's just dad. I'm going to go ask Chef Marty. Let's see if she's in here. Uh, Chef Marty. Uh, good morning, Chef Marty. Uh, can you understand me? I know I think I'm speaking English, but I think it's coming out all wrong. Princess, you're speaking gibberish. You should go see a doctor. I think there's something wrong. Oh, goodness. Chef Marty can't understand me either. Okay, Chef Marty, I think you're right. I probably should go see a doctor. Thank you so much. This is, uh, this is so weird. I mean, like, why can't no one understand me? I think I'm speaking English, but obviously I'm not. I must be coming out all wrong. What's wrong with my brain? It's not working properly. Okay, I definitely have to get to the hospital as soon as possible and figure out what's going wrong. Maybe my brain is turning to mush. Oh, this is not good. I really hope a doctor can help me. Oh gosh, I gotta get to this hospital quick. I don't know what's going on with me. I'm so scared. I mean, what if I can never speak again and no one ever understands me? Or what if I even die? I mean, this is terrible. What about Buttons and Daisy and Cassie and Brian and Little Guardy? Who's gonna look after all them? And Ellie, baby Ellie, she's just turned into a princess and now I'm gonna die. Oh gosh, okay, wait, I think, okay, I'm just at the hospital now. Okay, let's park up here. Oh gosh, oh no, oh, my brain's not working properly. I've crashed my car. Oh, lucky I'm at the hospital. Okay, let's go in here. Um, uh, hello, miss. Um, my name is Little Kelly and I need to see a doctor. Oh no, she probably can't even understand me. Okay, miss, I'm gonna need you to calm down. I can't understand a word you're saying. Okay, calm down and tell me what's wrong. Oh, okay, I guess um something must be wrong with your head. Okay, uh, I'm gonna get a doctor to see you right away. This seems urgent. Oh my gosh, look at all these patients in here. Where is this doctor's office? I'm so confused. Uh, I can't find it anywhere. Oh, maybe it's over here. Uh, recovery room one. No, that's not it. Recovery room two. The theater. Oh, uh, let me ask one of the nurses at the station. Uh, hello there, nurse. I was just wondering if you could point me towards the doctor's office. I have an appointment with him. Girl, I have not a clue what you just said, but it sounds like you might need to go see a doctor. There's an office upstairs right beside the theater and the doctor will be there. Oh, 
thank you so much. Okay, so we need to go find upstairs. Recovery room, theater. Oh, that looks like a scan room. Please wash hands. There's a theater in there. Okay, let's go upstairs. It looked like someone was getting an operation already. Uh, let's see. Okay, oh gosh, look at all the surgeons in there watching an operation. Okay, oh, doctor's office. Okay, let's go in here. Uh, hey, doc. Uh, I really need your help. Um, I, no one can understand what I'm saying. I think there's something going mush in my brain. I just feel like I'm going crazy. Okay, little Kelly, we're going to have to do some scans to figure out why your speech is like this. Okay, Doc, uh, I'll go down to the scan room right away. I want to get this fixed. Okay, uh, so let's go back down. Uh, I need to get changed into the little dressing gown hospital thing. Okay, I'll do that first, and then I can do my scans, and hopefully they all come back clear. The scan room is in here. Yeah, look, it's back there. Okay, uh, okay I better go get changed first. Um, okay, let me see. Uh, this room's empty. Okay, let's choose this room. Okay, let's get changed into my overalls. <laughs> Okay, I'm in my overalls. Okay, now it's time to go to the scan room. I'm really, really nervous. What if something really, really bad shows up on this? I mean, what if I never get better? What if no one can ever understand me? What if I die? I just, I can't deal with this. Okay, okay, well, uh, I better just go get the scan done. I can't believe my brain. It just feels like it stopped working. Okay, uh, scan room, that's in here. Okay, the doctor's already here. Hey, doc, uh, I guess I have to go in here. Uh, okay, let's shut that there. Okay, uh, Doc, I'm ready to go. Oh, I forgot he can't understand me. Uh, okay, I'll give him a thumbs up. Recording three, two, one. Okay, I'm glad that's all over. Okay, uh, Doc, I'll go wait in your office, and when you're ready, you can come give me the news. Oh, gosh, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Oh, he can't even understand what I'm saying. I'm sure he'll come up to his office with the news anyway. Oh, gosh. <sighs> Okay, Doc, give me the news. I don't know how to tell you this, little Kelly, but there's an infection in your brain and we're going to have to get you into surgery right away. An infection in my brain? What? This is just ridiculous. But if I need to go to surgery, that's what needs to be done. Okay, Doc, I'll go down to the nurse and get ready. I'll see you in the theater. Oh, okay, make sure you do your best work, okay? I, I don't want to die. Oh, gosh, I can't believe this. Brain surgery? I mean, on top of everything else, how did an infection in my brain happen? I wasn't even... Uh, I don't even know. Oh, gosh, I need to sit down to process this. It's just too much. I can't breathe. I think I'm having a panic attack. Okay, okay. It's okay. The doctor is awesome. He, he's, I'm going to be in great hands. He's going to do the best he can do. Okay, it's time to get ready for surgery. Nurse, hold that still. If we make one wrong move here, she could be stuck like this forever. went well look there's the x-rays i can't believe this i have to wait for the doc to come in and tell me how it went i'm so nervous that, that something went wrong and i'm gonna be stuck this way forever oh i guess i just have to wait and see okay little kelly the surgery was successful i'm going to need you to speak now so we know that it all worked Hey Doc, I think the surgery worked. Can you understand me? Yay! It worked, it worked, I'm back to normal. That infection didn't stop me. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Doc. That was awesome. You saved my life. I'll never be able to repay you. I wonder where that infection came from. Well, it doesn't really matter. At least it's fixed now. Thank you so much. Glad to help, Princess. Oh my gosh, you guys, what a crazy day. I had an infection in my brain, which meant I could only speak gibberish. Well, only people could understand me in gibberish, but when I spoke, I could understand it. It was all pretty crazy. I wonder how I got it. Oh, but anyway, I'm all fixed now, thanks to that doctor. He was awesome. But guys, oh, if you enjoyed this episode and you're glad that I've got my brain back to work, working back to normal, make sure to leave a like and a comment. Don't forget to subscribe and check me out on Instagram and Twitter and Snapchat too. All the links are down below along with the rest of the links to the little club. 
Oh, gosh, I don't even know what to say. I'm so happy, guys. But until next time, see you again soon.